Welcome to my channel Granny AI. When your body's metabolism starts slowing in your 30s, so, too, does the bioenergy of skin cells, which powers the creation of collagen, activates repair processes, and even helps absorb and process ingredients applied to your complexion. When bioenergy drops, it's like your skin is getting tired and no longer firing on all cylinders, says Kimball, the study's lead researcher. She says the key ingredient for revving up the cell metabolic engine is niacinamide, otherwise known as vitamin B3, which has been shown to raise skin's bioenergy levels. Around 40, cellular senescence kicks in. It's a complicated process in which the natural life cycle of skin cells is arrested, and it could affect your convection in many ways. At this point, skincare ingredients like retinol, glycolic acid, and peptides become important. Because, according to New York facial plastic surgeon doctor Michelle Yagoda, they help jumpstart the cell processes that are starting to lag. As you transition into menopause, average age 51, skin barrier function weakens, which makes skin dry and unable to retain enough hydration on its own. Experts say that rich moisturizers like oils and petrolatum can help counteract the process. Then, in your 60s, all the aging processes mentioned here dramatically accelerate. But there's good news, according to researchers at McMaster University in Hamilton. Ontario aerobic exercise like jogging or cycling twice a week has the ability to transform the protein structure of skin in those 65 and older, so it more closely resembles the skin of those 20 to 40. That's a lot of information to process. But the main takeaway is that using different skincare ingredients as you progress through life, along with exercising, will go a long way toward helping you look younger than the age on your driver's license. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to comment the video and subscribe my channel.